Hello kids and welcome to our virtual awards ceremony. Congratulations to all of you participating and submitting your music creations. I'm extremely excited to announce the winners in the Strawbees Global Music Challenge in a couple of seconds. I've been on the scout for fun, creative musical inventions. We look for creativity, sustainability, basic coding skills, and teamwork. There have been over 1,000 votes cast in the popular vote and we can see that it's a worldwide engagement. There have been two groups participating. The first group of schools and the second group is home learners. Let's start with the school winners. The overall winner which blew our minds when it comes to unity and bringing their old culture and poetry into the musical performance is School Right to Play with the team performance Violence in Schools from Beirut, Lebanon. The individual performance at the beginning, the complexity of the instruments and the poem tackling violence in schools carried such a strong message that this deserves to be seen and heard by the world. <laughs> And the most creative award goes to Jin Shan Primary School Team Candy Singapore. This team impressed the judges with their unique designs, their courage to throw over a prototype and restart, and their colorfulness and playfulness. most sustainable award goes to Right to Play Team Right to Education Beirut, Lebanon The judges love that they include other performance instruments, upcycling, recycling materials and using the materials they have in imaginative ways. The Best Teamwork Award goes to Admiralty Primary School Team ADP Singapore This team showed excellent collaboration skills between the team members. Students were also key contributors during the presentation in the video and most transparent with their process. Some in the group must be musicians. Now we move on to the Home Learners Awards. The overall winner, which thoroughly impressed us, goes to Sarah Huni from Laval, Canada for her backup band. Sarah's project was a brilliant implementation of exploring the one-man band idea. Her ability to share what she has done and being able to articulate it well and in a methodical way was excellent. Also, she got some extra brownie points for her Harry Potter one. And the most creative award goes to... Esri from Montreal, Canada with her waving cat music invention. Esri's project has some cheeky tweaks, she unlocked the secret of playing three notes with two keys and the judges love the fact that she added light and magic. This is my dream state on how kids can start prototyping at home. The most sustainable award goes to... Joa Dupree from St. Odell, Canada with his spongy music invention. The judges loved the minimalistic but effective solution, what a fantastic sketch too. 
Definitely the most sustainable solution in the group home learning. Ladies and gentlemen, with hundreds of votes, the People's Choice Award goes to... Admiralty Primary School, Team ADP Singapore. Again, confirms their excellent teamwork skills. They also managed to motivate a large group of supporters to vote for them. This was a very clear win and well deserved. Thank you kids for participating. Your ideas and creative thinking is what exactly what I imagine should happen at home or at school using strawbees. You not only inspired your fellow comrades, but also us, judges and teachers around the world with your work. We promise we'll do our best to keep bringing out more awesome hands-on experiences and lessons to get you excited and want to learn more. For those of you who didn't participate this round, register for next year's challenge now. See you at registration. Last but not to be the least, I would like to thank our partners Soundtrap, Mozilla and Jamstick for their awesome rock and roll prizes and helping us make this competition as cool as it was. So, don't forget, let's keep inventing. See you out there. Bye!